The Carolina Mudcats return to Five County Stadium tonight to take on the Salem Red Sox. CBS 17's Chris Clark is live in Zebulon with a uh, look at what we can expect for the first home game of the season. I understand it's two dollar taco mm -hmm. night. If I Venmo you twenty bucks, am I gonna get them tacos? <laughs> What you're going to have is uh, you're going to be out $20, and uh, I'm going to be full of tacos. I'm just going to tell you right now. I'm about to go over there and see exactly what that's all about. I can smell them coming in here right now, and they smell awesome. So we're going to have a complete report on that coming up at 6. But, yeah, man, I mean, it's baseball's back. And I mean baseball, you know, the great way. Not not that rainy stuff we had last week where, it, you know, it was just, you know, coming down in buckets and sheets and sideways. And they got the games in, don't get me wrong, but it was a sloppy, just a disgusting mess. No, we got perfect weather. It's sunshiny. We got these nice blue Carolina skies. We got these crisp Mudcats uniforms. They're taking on the Salem Red. I'm not going to say that name just because of my allegiances at the uh, major league level, but they're taking on that other team from up there in Salem. And it's one. It's the day that I've been waiting for ever since uh, the year started. We caught up with a couple of the players a little bit earlier to ask them about what it's like playing down here in Zebulon, playing down here in Five County Stadium, and just how much this home crowd means to them. Really excited just to play in front of a, a good community and a good fan base with um, a lot of my good friends I've been working out with and stuff like that for a while. So just getting out in the field and uh, getting the first couple games going really is, really is exciting. And uh, before we came out here, I grabbed my bat, was going to take some batting practice, took a few practice wings and realized I am not 23 years old anymore. So I am going to continue to talk about this sport and love every step of it. But coming up in sports at six, we're going to talk about uh, a lot of non-baseball stuff. Kyle Filipowski coming back to Duke. UNC picked up another player. We got a player leaving the NC State football team. So just because it's baseball season doesn't mean the rest of the sports world does not continue to roll right on. But uh, really enjoying myself out here in Zebulon at Five County Stadium. Hoping this day does not end. I'm Chris Clark, CPS 17 Sports. I'm really curious what kind of tacos they have out there. I don't, I don't know a thing Chris <laughs> said after he said I was going to lose twenty dollars and he was going <laughs> to eat all the tacos. So we're done for now. All right, brother. Thank you. We appreciate it. Uh,